Hi, I'm Bill Coleman, and this is Peter Walsh from Home and Community Options. Peter is a Blandon Award winner tonight. Peter, tell us about your project at Home and Community Options. Well, first, I just want to thank Blandon for the support they gave us that enabled us to create this application. We've developed a system that enables us to provide remote supervision for developmentally disabled adults. My tongue is a little quiet here. I'm so excited with this. Remotely, and so we can eliminate a night staff from caring for our clients. And this saves us money, but most importantly, it provides these clients with more independence, and they're excited about that. The men are really excited. So we've got a traditional kind of security system, surveillance cameras, Internet-based intercoms, video conferencing, all in these different layers that a remote attendant can engage to supervise these persons, these people, independently and remotely. And that's a wonderful thing. We're just really excited about that. We had just a meeting today with Winona County, and they are going to be hiring us to use our system to help a couple remain independent in their apartment. Otherwise, they'd have to move up. So we're really excited about this. That's very entrepreneurial, too, which is one of your goals. That's one of our goals, is we hope to be able to help provide another revenue stream for home and community options. How about your health records? We have a client record system that we've developed also. We call it eFile. And eFile enables us to use our own forms. So as we looked at other proprietary kinds of things we could buy, we had to use their forms. And our staff just didn't like that at all. And so this system allows us to use our forms. Everything's on file, no paper, online. And all 23 homes can access their stuff locally. So it's all backed up nightly and so forth. So it's very good. Very good. Well, congratulations, Peter. Thank you very much, Bill. All right.